Hello world, this is Pink Swan, back with a new tutorial. <laughs> and uh, if you know how lit my playlist was while I make my wigs, then you'll see <laughs> why I'm vibing so hard right now. So stay tuned while I show you how to create a 360 frontal unit from start to finish. Now this is a new product I've just launched on the pinkswan.com online store. This is the head lock wig mold tool. No saran wrap, no tape, no measurements. Create custom head mold in under two minutes. Using a heating gun, you want to warm the heating plate until it is clear, then it is ready to be molded to your head. Set the mold with a blow dryer on cool setting. You are free to trace your hairline before you set the mold with a blow dryer or you can wait till afterwards, whatever works for you. So for this video, I did go ahead and trace my hairline after I had already set the wig mold. And as you can see, it gives you an exact replica of your head with all your crooks, braids, bumps, dips, everything. <laughs> After I traced my hairline on the wig mold, I did use a hot knife to go ahead and carve out my hairline. Next, just fit your custom wig mold over a canvas head matching the circumference of your own head. Average head circumference is 22 inches. So if you have a 22 inch canvas block, that should be fine. And as you can see, using the wig mold, once you set it, it turns into hard plastic. So there's no need to stuff your canvas block or anything to get a truly custom fit when creating your wigs. Now, if you haven't already checked out my channel, I do have a video of me sewing down a 360 frontal um, in preparation for a wig. So if you haven't already, go ahead and check that out. Uh, with that being said, I'm going to skip that part of the video and get into um, the main construction of the wig making the 360 frontal i'm going to be using the curl pattern is jerry curly this is the 18 inch length i'm going to be using this along with three 26 inch jerry curly bundles you can find them at pinkswan.com with bundles starting at 32 dollars See, this is why I live for a 360 frontal unit. I love their versatility. Because you're able to get the lace all the way around your perimeter, but you also get to make the crown of your unit as full as you like, which is not always the case um, if you've ever worn a full lace wig. So I definitely prefer the 360 frontal units over a full lace unit. So tune in while I complete this 360 custom unit. If you have any other types of units that you want to see me create, go ahead and drop it in the comments below. If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. Check out my other videos. Yeah!
Thank <laughs> you.